Hi, in this video, we are going to talk about the center radius form of the equation of the circle, also known as the standard form of the equation of the circle. So, at the end of this uh, lesson, you'd be able to correctly determine the center radius form of the equation of the circle and correctly apply the center radius form in solving real-life problem. But before that, ano nga ba ibig sabihin ng circle? Balikan natin, ano? Um, a circle is the set of all points in a plane equidistant from a fixed point called the center. Okay, so yung circle, it's the set of all the points. Okay, hindi yung space sa loob, but the points, the points that are equidistant. So they have the same distance from the center of the circle. Yung radius naman, it's the fixed distance. Okay? It's the fixed distance from the center to the circumference of the circle. So, this is the circle. These are all, um, this is a set of all the points no? uh, that are equidistant from this point right here. Okay? So, the figure shows the graph of a circle with center HK center p and uh, the coordinates of that point are hk so h is the x coordinate and k is the y coordinate and the radius r so this is the radius this is the distance from point from the center to uh, the given point q um, x y so the standard form of the equation of a circle also known as the center radius form is um given by the equation x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared. So, ito yung standard form of the equation of the circle. Saan nga ba nang galing yan? Okay? Um, paano siya na-generate? So, using the standard form of the equation of the center, it is called center radius form because we only have to know the center and the radius of the circle in order to express the equation into standard form. The standard form of the equation of the circle is uh, based on the distance formula. Okay, distance formula. Kinuha lang natin yung um, formula in getting the distance or the radius, actually, you know, the distance between the center and any point on the circle. So, let's say we have point Q with coordinates x, y. So, the distance from, uh, from point Q uh, or from P to point Q is given by R. So, it's the radius. Okay? So, to get the length or the distance R, we need to use the dis distance formula. So, we have R equals the square root of x minus h squared plus y minus k squared because um if you can still remember the distance formula um we have a separate video on that so the distance formula we have the square root of um x sub 2 ano? x sub 2 minus x sub 1 squared plus y sub 2 minus y sub 1 squared so that's the distance formula so substituting with these coordinates so eto na siya Squaring both sides, we have r squared equals x minus h squared plus y minus k squared. So, ito na yung, this, uh, ito na yung center radius form of the circle. Okay, center radius form of the circle. So, again, para maalala, um, standard form of the equation of the circle is also called center radius form of the circle. Kasi, we only have, we only need the center and the radius in order for us to generate the standard form of the uh, equation of the circle. So, the standard form of the equation of a circle would center at the origin. So, in this figure, the center of this circle is not on the origin. Ano? Um, if this is the origin, if this is 0, 0, uh, then we have this circle right here. So, this is a circle with uh, the center at the origin. So, when we say uh, center at the origin, the um, coordinates are 0, 0. Okay, 0, 0 on H, 0 on K. Okay. Paano nga ba yan? So, if a circle has a center at, zero, at the origin, which is 0, 0, and has radius R, the equation becomes X squared, 
plus y squared equals r squared. So, madilili na lang siya masyado. Kasi you don't have to express it as x minus h, ano? Um, and y minus k. So, diretso na siya. Uh, let's say, because uh, if we have the standard form of the equation of the circle, that would be x minus h uh, squared, sorry, squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared. So, since 0 yung hk, so x minus 0 is just x. So, x squared plus y minus 0 is just y. So, that's y squared equals r squared. So, mandali na lang siya masyado if the center is at the origin. Let's have an example. Find the equation of the circle with center at the origin and a radius of 6. So, center is at the origin and the radius is 6. So, r equals 6 and the center is at 0, 0. That's the center of the circle. So, let's say the center is uh, C, 0, 0. So, we have diretsya na, no? So, that's x squared plus y squared equals 6 squared. So, that is x squared plus y squared equals 36. So, this is now the equation or the standard equation of the circle. Example number 2. Write an equation of the circle with center at 0, negative 9 and a radius of 5 units. Okay, yung center niya is uh, the center is on 0, negative 9, and the radius is equal to 5 units. So, we have x minus h squared plus y minus k squared equals r squared. So, we have x minus yung h natin is 0. Substitute lang natin. And then, yung k natin is 9, ano? So, negative 9. So, minus negative 9, that becomes plus 9. K squared, and our r is 5, so that's 5 squared. And so we have x squared plus y minus 9, uh, I'm sorry, y plus 9 squared equals 5 squared is 25. Okay, and this is the center radius form of the equation of the circle. So, kapag kaganito na siya, ang, ang standard form ng equation ng circle, madali lang i-identify yung center ng circle at ang radius ng circle. Kasi ano ang center niya, kung wala siyang ibang, hindi siya nakaganito ng form, ayan, ibig sabihin nito, h coordinate is 0. And the y coordinate is negative 9. Okay, pag plus yan dyan, ibig sabihin it's negative, okay? Negative 9. So, the center is at 0, negative 9 without looking at the, at this one. Just by looking at this standard form of the equation of the circle, malalaman mo na kung ano ang center at ang radius. So, ito naman ang radius, square root mo lang yan. So, that's 5. That's the radius.